it's more than just using everything that's in the visual effects uh, box of tricks and special effects and miniatures and all that. It's, uh, it's working in unison with the rest of the film, being part of the creative process right from the very beginning all the way through production right to the very end. And I think that's, that's what got us where we are. Well, I think, you know, every year we always try and get closer and closer to reality. And this time we had access to the amazing skills of Kip, who's uh, one of the world's leading theoretical physicists. And he gave us the maths, the physics, which describes the universe and how these extraordinary things would actually look if you were able to go and see them. So, you know, every year we get closer and closer to reality. And so this is, uh, as I said in my speech, it's showing us the outrageous beauty of the universe. The story, you know, just to make this film, I had to go away from my home for over a year, away from my, uh, my young children. So I felt very much uh, uh, an empathy with the character, with Matthew McConaughey's character. And, uh, and that helped inform everything you do, particularly in the end sequence of the film, where we're trying to maintain the, the emotional intensity whilst also providing a spectacular result. I don't know, you guys, have you got, how do you feel about that? Yeah, I just wanted to mention too that you know Christopher Nolan really wanted us to ground the movie in a in a very realistic, very humanistic uh, story, and so we're going to the far ends of the universe. But he always constantly emphasized that we wanted to make sure that uh, we brought humanity with us, and so in the visual effects, as awe-inspiring as they are, it's still backed by uh, family and caring and love, and uh, I think having that guidance from him was really what helped us achieve what we did. For the latest from HitFix, visit HitFix.com or download the new HitFix app on your Roku device.